Now in this video, I really just want to share some taurine benefits as well as provide some tips on getting it. Now before I get started, uh, down below there's a link and if you click on it, I'm giving away a free video-based guide on dietary supplements and alternative medicine. Now in your body, you have something known as amino acids, which are like the building blocks of life. They're used to build things like skin, nails, hair, muscles, and Taurine is a non-essential amino acid. Now, what that means is your body can create it. Now, you might be thinking, well, if my body can create taurine, then why do I need it in a supplement? Or why is it in energy drinks? Now, those are some great questions. The reason why is because taking more of it can give you some benefits that you may really enjoy and like. For example, it can help with exercise. And I'm going to provide a study because I like studies. It's like real. It's like proof. Now, in a study published in the Journal of Cardiology, they looked at 29 patients with heart failure. They were either given a supplement with 1,500 milligrams of taurine or placebo. Now, exercise time and distance all increased significantly in patients who took a taurine supplement. Now, another big way that taurine can be very helpful if you take a lot of it, like in a supplement, is with heart disease, which is this big, big problem around the world. Now, in a study published in the European Journal of Nutrition, researchers looked at 14,000 women, a lot of women, not sure why it was all just women, and they noticed that high taurine levels, women that had, that had high levels of taurine, were 60% less likely to develop or die from cor coronary heart disease than the women with low levels of taurine. Now, if that wasn't enough, there's all these other studies out there that show that high levels of it can help with diabetes, which is not a big, big problem. Uh, tinnitus, which is like ringing in the ears. It's, it's a horrible disease. Vision problems, liver disease, as well as seizures. Now, if you're wondering how the heck do you get this stuff, it's in common foods like eggs, milk, seafood, uh, as well as meat. And the average person, they get somewhere around 60 milligrams. Now, if you take a dietary supplement, you can get a whole lot more. The problem is, well, there's a lot of junk out there. Supplement, when it comes to supplements, there's so many choices out there, and the industry is unregulated, not just in America, but in a lot of countries out there. What that means is it's very easy for companies to make crap, put it out there. Now, to make your life a little bit easier, I created this whole report and video guide about supplements and alternative medicine. Now, the reason I created this whole video guide because I really feel that I have some information that can help a lot of people. And a lot of people don't know about what I'm talking about, okay? So, if you check it out, it's definitely going to be worth your time. I've gotten a lot of positive feedback from creating it, and I'm sure you're going to love it. It's going to save you money, it's going to be great for your health, and you might even be enter entertained as a bonus. Um, now, so if you're interested in checking it out, just click on the link below the video I made for you. Uh, thank you for watching. I, I hope this video might have been helpful. I if you liked it, please hit the little thumbs up button. That helps me. And until next time, have a great rest of your day, and, uh, and bye for now.